How easy and how convenient is it for us to blame everything and everybody for the things that we have going on in our lives? Most of you are waking up every day looking for pain, dysfunction, drama, unemployment, being broke, struggling, dropping every excuse in the book about your childhood and the problems and dysfunction that you grew up in that's stopping you from becoming successful. You don't like your friends, so why are you still fucking with them? You don't trust your managers, agents, and lawyers, so why are they still there? Do you really expect your life and career to be any different from messing with the same things, people, and situations? And I was reading a newspaper that said that, that millions of people are dying because of, of what they're eating, talking about their diet. So that even more are dying because of what's eating them. message isn't to tear you down and contribute to your negativity. My intention is to just say, enough is enough. I want you to share this message. And stop being a lazy person that's full of excuses, coming up with every excuse in the world as to why you ain't winning. You are the reason you're not winning. You keep messing with negative, evil, and dysfunctional people and expecting positive results. Stop complaining about being out of shape when you never go to the gym. Stop looking at your stomach when you get out of the shower and your body and complaining about the way you look when you're eating everything in sight and never going to the gym. You are the reason you look the way you look you are the reason you're unemployed. You are the reason why your surroundings are so dysfunctional and negative. We are being raised in a generation of people that come up with every excuse in the book as to why they are not winning. Excuses sound best to the people that's making them up. You got every excuse in the world. That's why your shit ain't moving. That's why ain't nothing change and nothing will change. Because you have convinced yourself that everything is wrong, is negative, and nothing will change. And guess what? It won't change. Change your mind and it will change your life.
I'm frustrated with the amount of people that are not successful because they have thought their way into a depression. You have thought your way into negativity and misery. You have thought your way into holding on to a dude or a girl that you broke up with a year or two ago and you're still sad and miserable. They didn't moved on with their life. It's all in the mind. Change your mind and it will change your life. You just have to, you just have to wake up. You just have to break that negative spirit. You have to break through all of that shit that you're carrying. I don't feel sorry for you. You feel sorry for yourself. That's the problem. Even when positive people are trying to give you all this good energy, you have tricked your mind to turn every positive thing that they say into something negative. Every time they say anything to try and motivate you and inspire you, you, you turn every negative thought and every, you turn every positive thought, every positive intention, everything that they trying to, to boost your spirits up, you flip it, shake it, manipulate it, and you, have, you are so determined to be negative and miserable. It's unbelievable. If nothing around you changes, change the things that are around you. That there are people out here that could be more successful, but you have fought your way into a depression. You have fought your way into gravitating and moving into the direction of anything and anybody that's negative. Everything about your life that you decided that you wanted for yourself is so negative, but yet you, you're expecting to produce positive results. The outcome of your life and your career is based on the choices that you've made. I love you. Asking that you get off the pity potty and stop feeling sorry for yourself. For every level, there's another devil. Get off the pity potty. It's your season. It's your moment. Right now. question is, are you just going to look at this video and decide, wow, that was some powerful shit, and do the same fucking thing? I want you to share this message. I want you to tag whoever needs to see this message. If you make it to the end of this message, I want you to write, enough is enough. It's a new day. <laughs>